New here at 6, an update to a CBS2 investigation. A man who has spent three decades behind bars for a murder he says he didn't commit. He's now getting one more shot to prove he didn't do it. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey has been digging into this case. The reason that man in prison is because of me, you know. I know I came to court and lied in court, but I say this until I die. Jane had nothing to do with that case. That's the confession video obtained by the CBS2 investigators last summer. With nothing to win or lose, co defendant Michael Johnson said James Bannister is innocent. But Bannister has been in prison for the last 32 years, ever since he and six other men were charged in a November 1989 stray bullet shooting through the window of a building on the campus of the Illinois Institute of Technology. The bullet killed an innocent security guard and another man who was the intended target. It was devastating. It was that was hard trying to keep your composure while lies are being told. Bannister was convicted twice on the testimony of witnesses. The first, a 12 year old boy who later recanted. The second, Michael Johnson, who says he only pointed the finger at Bannister because prosecutors offered to lighten his own sentence. We we're really excited. Um, we raced quite a few arguments in the petition. On Monday, attorney Jennifer Blagg presented several different arguments for why Bannister is innocent and why his case should be reexamined. And today, a Cook County judge agreed to advance three of those claims and take a second look at the arguments during an evidentiary hearing. How big is this decision? Oh, it's a big decision. It's a it's a fair decision. Um, I've dealt with many cases where I should get a hearing and I don't get a hearing. So today's a big day. It's a big day for James, a big day for justice, a step in the right direction, we should say. Blagg says Bannister is cautiously optimistic about this update. He's been working out lately in prison, saying he wants to be healthy when he finds freedom. Megan Hickey for the CBS2 Investigators.